Uh, your first few times you got lost in time, wanting to go somewhere and being in the wrong time. <laughs> I, I feel like I kind of got lucky in remembering how to actually travel to a different, to the, to the other time. Because I was just kind of like sitting there and thinking to myself, uh, you know, how do I actually go to the other time? I just wanted the treasure chest. I didn't want to go with these guys. Halt, humans. We cannot permit you to advance any further. The Hydra is the tutelary deity of this forest. Hi-ho. Without it, this forest will die. Uh, should you still wish to advance, you will have to get by us. Prepare for battle, wicked humans. Uh, so when I went to the beach, I was like, how do I, how do I, you know, utilize this dimensional vortex thing? And it was just by happenstance that I, holy cow, that I thought about the, the way to do it. How do I select... I didn't equip, um, didn't e I didn't equip Razzly with, like, anything, which is probably why Razzly is taking so much damage. Cover all right quick. Thought they would do less damage by having less dwarves. <laughs> hey, heals. shenanigans. Uh, let's cast a heal, because I want to know how much this heals for. I don't want to heal the enemy. Okay, that's a lot, actually. Played this game when it was new, and then beat it like a couple of years ago. So basically, you remember nothing. How far are we in? Uh, not very far. I have... I have about... I think I'm about like 10 hours in. Turn. 
Uh, yeah, about 10 hours in. Um, more specifically, I have uh, went into the Viper Manor. I did all the Viper Manor stuff, and I have now successfully completed my first um, dimensional warp, I guess, to back to the real world, not the alternate world, and I'm searching for the Hydra Humor. That is currently where I'm at right now, is inside the Hydra Forest. Alright, 15 HP, plus one magic, okay, let's go. Uh, I think we're good. Too strong. Are we unable to stop them? It will forever be the case. The Hydra must be up ahead. Let's go, Sergi. Did it really? How is this possible? Like, nothing, nothing changed. Is it your intention to kill the forest? They're strong. Wait, so how do I get to that one? Let's, let's go ahead and save. Big fan of saving. Can I save? I'm saving again. Fortunately, by picking the Hydra path, you're going to miss your favorite character. That's, uh, that's just how it goes. And I don't know what I'm doing. That's, uh... Well, that, that's just how it has to go. But I'll forgive you. I have a feeling that I will probably have the most unexciting um, party because it's just going to be so generic. You know, everybody has that party. Should have done the uh, the thing to see what it does. Oh my gosh! Is that you, heels? That I have uh, nine plus Discord messages. Someone else blowing me up. I did ask somebody earlier today for. Oh, definitely don't want to go that way. Uh, for. For some uh, information. 
It is not. It is not Felix. I actually do want to know what they're talking about, though. So let's see what they're talking about. Oh, VR headsets? I can't be doing none of that. Whoa, whoa, okay, never mind. That's, that's totally different. Oh, they're Oculus headsets. Never mind. <laughs> it was an index, you know, like, okay. We might have to, might have to be a little sad about it, but you know, nobody's sad about Oculus. Suck a food Facebook. Oh, you know what? Maybe. Oh, apparently I'm poisoned. Probably want to fix that. do that and then walk away okay you're you're not going to be very helpful okay so there's like another pathway how do I I get over there Saws the treasure chest. I don't see how to get there. Saving. You be fowler of the forest, human vermin. Prepare to receive the anger of nature that you so deserve. I ho. Oh great Hydra, hear my voice. Turn on these wretched humans. Teach them how the forest, no our planet, is pained by their existence. I ho, Hydra away. There's so many bosses in this dungeon. This sure as heck ain't my world. I can't believe there is a Hydra before my eyes. It's coming. Looks more like a snake. Forgot to equip again. Buckle food. That's a sneaky pathy. The Y was a typo, but you're going to pretend it's a new thing instead. It's okay. If, uh, if people got paid for the amount of typos that I made, they would actually be millionaires.
All right, I want to try Raz Star. I don't know what it does. It does 135 damage. That's what that does. Heck yeah. Putrid Odor. Okay. Uh, it comes to my attention now that Greco was the guy who had all of my status ailment prevention stuff equipped. Now we don't have any of that. Status helmet is, so I'm just gonna power through it. I believe in you. Uh, you're yellow. All of this is incredibly disappointing. And defend. Hey, Krayson, thank you very much for the 19 months. Did I feed 100 dragons? Yes, I did. <laughs> yes, I did. And, uh... Honestly, I... I was disappointed by... by the reward that I got. Did I just mash buttons? Because that's what you did? Uh, I feel like I was a little bit more strategic with it. But... Um, I feel like the best way to complete that involves some sort of button mashery, so I can see why you went that route. Dizzy. Everybody's dizzy. Right. Um, do you have... You do not have. I guess I already used that. Which means I have to use Surge. That went away so fast. I, I think it said defense temporarily decreased. Oh, are you almost dead? Because that would be great. I did, yeah, I did. It's it's on the oh wow, eleven damage. It's on the vaunts. I have proof. Adventure Josh was there. He can bounce. Don't you dare kill Korcha. You made sure the ones on the far right were always fed. And if you were going to miss one, let it be on the left ones. That was also a strategy that I was employing because it was much easier to 
to deal with the ones on the uh, the left hand side that were next to the feed. So, um, one strategy I was going back and forth with was I would sit in the the middle, um, the middle dragon or whatever it was. Um, and that would allow me, you know, to go each way equally, but also I would try the second to last, uh, option as well. Um, and I, I feel like I got some amount of, of, uh, success with that. You had to use slow down to get that pretty sure. It's a little disappointing, Heels. Um, I have to admit, I'm a little disappointed in you right now. Okay. We have no healing options for Razzly. So, Photon Ray. Oh, we have, like, no stamina either. And you're not dead yet. Oh, my goodness. You got Razzly. Uh, I think I'd rather defend. Go made the enemy defense increase, not yours decrease. Okay, well, there's two people dead. Does this game have to be so difficult? Let me guess, it's dead. This game literally hates me. I feel like every single... Oh, pretty much every boss has either killed me in this dungeon, or left me in this state of only having one person alive at the end. <sighs> Life is hard. Congratulations! Nobody gets healing, or buffs, or anything. What do you humans intend to do with our mother planet? Not thinking of the future, cutting down trees like there's no tomorrow, burning the forest to make your own, or make your towns even bigger, and all for what? Do you think that you are the only ones who live on this planet? Do you even know the, the works of life forms other than yourselves? Don't kid yourselves, you are just hairless apes, or worse. You are nothing more than freaks of evolution. It's very sad, but I can understand what he says. Why, we fairies are forest dwellers too, but I don't think all humans are bad. I'm sure that there are many human folk who love greenery and are kind to the smallest of life forms. I believe that is true. Okay. Might as well get a couple humors. Wait, Sergi, this Hydra is holding newborns in her womb. Hydra isn't extinct, and this forest isn't going to die as long as there's, uh, there is life. Uh, all that may be left is a small, fragile life force, but this forest will make it. Well, the Hydra disappeared, so it ain't making nothing. It is pretty greedy to hit six times, then cast. Lots of negative stamina. I'm, 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 I'm kind of okay with the negative stamina, just because I, I get everybody else's stamina up, and so it kind of works out. Uh, but, but yeah, I, I got destroyed. Now, there's not a single dwarf roaming in this forest anymore. Have they abandoned the place? Let's hurry. Windy outside. I guess we didn't learn how to 
in the stuffs. All of a sudden, the aura about the forest seems different. I can't really pinpoint what, though. Because I have a fairy in my party. Go spend a hundred monies and heal. Let's equip our fairy person. You yeah, had bronze. That works. Uh, you know, giving you more HP might not be a horrible thing. More magic would be fantastic. More attack power would be nice. More defense would be nice, too. Here, let's give you... No, you have the Iron Vest. Let's be a little greedy with this. Blah, 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 tomorrow, okay. Pretty sure there's no downside to choosing heal without consumables to end your fights. Not to just backseat the heck out of me. My goodness, heals. Just spoiling gang mechanics all over the place. What the heck is wrong with you? Um, I actually didn't know that. Um, I, I assumed that there would be some sort of downside to it because it doesn't make any sense that there isn't. So I'm just going to pretend that you didn't say that. I feel like there was a place here where I can just rest up and and stuff, but can't remember it for the life of me. Is this always here? Hmm. <laughs> I never did go through there. I do need to buy more consumables. Why don't we do that before we start going into dungeons? Show me your elements. Uh, ain't that many, but we can actually use a couple more of those. Fireballs. This uses up any leftover mana you have at the end of the fight, or any heal skills you have left. If you don't have any mana or any skills left, it does nothing. Very, very interesting. I guess that's something I could have tested. But there's still a bunch of mechanics that I don't know. Not that I'm asking to know about them, but um, there's still a bunch of mechanics that I don't know, so I uh, I wasn't sure how things uh, interacted with each other in that regard. Uh, the Pori Army is currently investigating the area. Is job off limit to the public? Okay, can't go over there yet. I don't think I went here in the real area.
Judging by that treasure chest, I was correct. Don't you dare. Serge and Lena forever. Hmm. Why would they bury Serge all the way out here? Or put his grave marker or whatever. That's just silly. Didn't we fall when we arrived here? Ah, you didn't have anything to say, Razley. You're in a new world now. Um, what was barring my way last time? I couldn't get the plants to cooperate. Still technically don't have any way of getting the plants to cooperate. I guess we can find out. You always fall into new dimensions, that's just common knowledge. And that, that one felt like more like a, a controlled descent than a fall. There's things I can test now that I have things. Thanks to Biba. Moment of truth. Waste time? Or amazingness? Hey, wait. You're just looking for trouble if you blow that flute here. Oh, come on. Come on. And blow the flute here. Come on. Life is hard. Such as my increased endeavors to waste more time by doing things that I feel like I should have known wouldn't work, but tried it anyways. Tried fighting that centipede guy, I think it was earlier this morning or yesterday. Do not recommend. Okay. 
these uh, these vines still do not like me. Oh, you're right, Sergi. The toxin levels seem higher. Blah, blah, blah. Must be mutated. I'm sure there is something that I can do there, but we'll worry about that later. Assuming I remember. Hey, Dante. How's Dark Souls treating you? Any more corrupted saves? Infuriating interactions? Yes, I do. It is ridiculously windy. Tomorrow is Taco Tuesday. I'm so excited. Speaking of Tuesday, I, uh, I got news from my boss. That uh, starting next week, if I wanted to, I can start choosing uh, my own schedule at work. Which means I can change my stream time to almost whatever I want it to be. Return to Gulduv. And so I have a whole week to figure out what I want my work schedule to be so that I can work or plan my stream schedule to coexist with it. Heck yeah, tacos. Heck yeah, tacos. Okay, you're just going to kick yourself out of my party. Uh, we haven't tried you. You're just... Just kind of worse than Greco, but... You're not, like, awful? I guess we're taking you. I'd rather not take you, but... I'll take you. Let's rush over to that doctor right away. Come on, you guys hurry too. Alright. We need we need to ask important questions here. They did not give me uh whatever his name is. They didn't give me his stuff. I mean I knew he was temporary, but. You know, like, come on. What the heck did I just do? What is this? Oh. If this is anything to go by, this is... There's actually not that many characters in this game. Ooh, actually... Actually, this... Is... Helpful. This is very helpful. I didn't, I didn't know that existed. Very nice. Actually, the 100% playthrough is going very smooth. There's been no real resistance, and you haven't died in a while. Save is nice and safe. <laughs> Not using a randomizer, so probably no chance of corruption. Okay. You're just chilling now, waiting on Krayson to catch up. You do love schedules. Yeah. Using your own schedule is pretty nice. I dig it. Sarah, just hurry up and get to the doctor right away. Oh, it's you dudes. The patient's strength is at its limit. Not the antidote.
And what's you, dudes? The patient strength is at its limit. Oh. Uh, here. Congrats on the new job. Welcome to the work and game grind. Time to level up adulting. Yeah, working from home is the best thing in the world. And I never want to do anything that is not working from home if I'm going to be working. Uh, can this be Hydra humor? But how? We will discuss that later. Uh, as long as we have this, making an antidote will be easier than catching a wave. We can save the girl with this. We will prepare an antidote right away. Nurse, help me with the preparations. Stat. Yes. I have no idea where in the world you found this, nor do I know who you really are. Now is not the time to ask such questions. You have done your part. Now you can leave the rest to me. And with that stoic head nod. Here at the dock, we've done what we can. Just trust them and wait. By the way, remember that thought later about how many characters are available? Okay. <laughs> I will forget. Uh, it's already close to nightfall. Doc, how is she? Will she be all right? Yes, she has passed the critical period. Uh, there are no signs of complications from the poison. The girl has held up well, but only thanks to you dudes. You have done the impossible by finding the antidote. I still cannot believe it. You, with the red bandana. You are Serge, correct? She would like to speak with you. It would be a little while, or it would be a little while before she falls asleep from the anesthetic. Will you speak with her, dude? Hey, dude. I like how Doc is baffled by you finding Hydra humor, but has no problem with someone apparently suffering from Hydra venom. <laughs> That's an interesting point, actually. <laughs> Uh, I will be in the room next door, so call me when you need me. And, uh, do not forget that even though the poison is gone, she has not completely recovered. Well then, catch you later, dude. Alright, dude. See it? You've become bloody handsome while I was out of it. Alright, calm down, kid. I don't know all the details, but I heard what happened from the dock. Looks like there's been a lot going on while I was asleep. I guess it proves that you can take care of yourself now, eh? Boy, Serge, you did good, mate. Why don't you uh, Why don't you look cheerful for a change? I, I would have been all right without any antidote at all. Struth, now I owe you one. Serge, thanks. A world different from our own. That is far... <laughs> Alright, man. That is far out, man. Uh, that there... Uh, that there really is such a thing. And you dudes are from this other world, I presume. Just to make it clear, Doc, the only one that's from the other world is Surge. All the others, including myself, are from this world. We're all with him for different reasons, though. I'm from the same world as Sergi, too. Oops, my bad. I totally forgot. Come to think of it, the first time we met you was in the Hydra Marshes. Yes, if Sergi hadn't come and saved me, I would have been big in big, big trouble. Another world, so I suppose some things are slightly different. The Hydra Marshes are a good example of this. Otherwise, we would have never found a Hydra in this world. Parallel worlds, never to cross each other, yet existing alongside one another. Hey Doc, let's not think too deeply about this. There isn't any easy way to explain it. Even after going through it myself, I st still doubt what I saw. Let's just drop the theories, Doc. The girl's been saved, that's all we need to know, right? Very like you, Korcha. But he's got a point, Doctor. Kid's life has been saved. I don't think we need to think about anything further for the time being. Well, I guess you are right. I cannot find an answer to this by thinking about it on my own. 
It's pretty late. We have been talking for quite some time. Let's call it a night. One good day's rest should be enough to let her get up and hang ten. Korcha is not so big on thinking. Well, I mean, his, uh, his special ability or what have you is literally him using his head as a projectile. So it makes a little bit of sense that he's not all the way up there. Piece of like lint or something flying around. Okay. Whatever was being stolen doesn't belong to me, so. What you gonna do, Serge? You've already found a way back to your own world, right? You could just go back home and live a peaceful life, pretending that nothing ever happened. But can you really forget everything you've seen here? And can you live with yourself after you turned your back on us? What? What? What kind of garbage are you trying to feed? I mean, really, we could just go back to our own world and just, just chill. Come to me, Surge, the Chrono Trigger. The Assassin of Time. Ooh. Let me see. I did save, right? Alright, I'm going to experiment a little. Let's go against the grain a little bit. I've been tempted to go against the grain in a couple of decisions in this game, and I haven't done so. And I think this one could be interesting. Let's go back home. Hopefully the game just doesn't end and punish me for, for that. Sergi, are you sure you're going to be satisfied with that? Think about it, Serge. Why did you take uh, the, the trouble to cross the uh, worlds to help Kid? It was not just because you wanted to go back to your world, right? You had utter reasons to come back to this world. Why did I add her into my party? Uh, actually, I just wanted to help her because, you know, she was dying, so I helped her out and then my obligations are done. I see. Then I'll stick around uh, with you a little longer. But just don't slow me down, you hear? I don't know what happened ten years ago, but it looks like Viper's mob has got something to do with it. Let's go after him. I need to go bash up that Lynx character and get me hands on the frozen flame. Lynx. He stole something precious from me taken away my future. I'll find him, no matter what it takes. Korcha, I heard that you helped in the search, too. It was nothing. Yeah? Well, thanks for nothing, then. <laughs> now then. At one point, I thought we were doomed for sure, but it looks like it's all settled now. All that's left is to take you guys back to Termina, right? My job ends there. You get a special discount price of 300 G. 300 gold for the round trip. Sorry, but I need to make a living too. This suck of food. You're pretty darn shrewd, eh? I shouldn't have thanked you earlier. Hmm? What is it? You looking for something? Yeah, the elements I had on the grid are gone. Why, Surge? Did you remove the elements from the grid? I don't even know what that means. If it wasn't you, then who did? The only ones looking over you while we were gone were the Doc and the Nurse. 
It should be in the room next door, so let's ask them when we head out. The dog should know something. I hope you're right. Excellent. I think I'm going to try to go against the grain this time. Game? I don't think so. Yeah, I was a little disappointed by that. It, like, at least give me the game over, you know. Uh-huh. Mel, what you doing? Hey, Blondie. If you want your stuff back, I challenge you to catch me. Mel, way... What is it, dude? Is Mel up to something again? Well, yeah, the same old mischief, but this time she's gone too far. Jeez, that idiot. What is she thinking? I don't get it. I'm sorry about her, kid. I'll get the stuff back from her later. So go easy on her, alright? That's uh, no problem. If it ain't anything, anything I'll suffer without anyway. Not to be rude, but I don't have time to play around with brats. I've got to go chase after Lynx now. Uh, what is it, Serge? I need those elements. Well, you're not wrong, but Korcha said that he'd get them back later. We don't have time to waste. Ain't that right, Serge? Come on, mate. Let's go. Now, let's go after Mel. All right, if you insist. Okay, then let's go find that brat right away. I'm ain't gonna wait for us. That's the plan, Korcha. Uh, why don't you help us out a bit? Uh, it'll be over a lot quicker that way. Gotcha. Yeah, I, I don't know if she's gonna lose the stealing one, but we ain't gonna lose the stealing one. Beginning to wonder if curing you was the right course of action. Such a ruckus in the clinic interferes with my work. But I guess your antics are proof of your youth, dude. Right, dude. No, the nerve of Korcha to charge you 300 gold after stealing all your elements. For real. Korcha's, Korcha's a sugafu. Let's just be honest here. Also, rearranging my party like this. The disrespect. Bring back memories, blah blah blah, southeast. Yes, 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 yes. Just wanted to make sure he didn't have a unique portrait or something, you know, could have recruited him or something. Would be kind of cool to have a, a dwarf dude. We'll go this way first. any sense to me. How could there be nothing behind here? Just makes no sense. Honestly? Honestly? Korcha should be giving me 300 money for having to put up with this garbage. That's... That's my thoughts on it. been unsuccessful in locating the Sakafu. Uh, oh hi there, there isn't much here but a home on the right and I feel at home. One of those villages, the land where the dragon sleeps. Yup. Inside this building. Gato. Yeah, 
if this person is not here, there's only one other place that she could be. As in prayer, you may not enter the shrine. I'll come back a little bit later. It shouldn't be that long. What brings you here, Korcha? It's rare to see you come out to this tower. Well, never mind that. By the way, have you seen Mel around here? We're looking for her right now. Mel, I haven't seen her today. Have you tried the residential tower? Well, she hasn't come this way. Thanks for the info. You heard she hasn't come by this way. The only place left is the residential tower. The sea is the only other place to hide. That's not likely. Once we corner her, it's all over. Let's go. Huh. I was headed for the residential tower. We've got her cornered now. Okay, let's go. Find her in no time. They've been chasing after her. The walk and talk is such a rare thing uh, in JRPGs. Uh, this is the end. There's no place to run. But what are we going to do? If all three of us barge in at once, she's going to escape. Uh, there are three exits to this tower. If we each go in through a different exit, there's no escape. Listen up. Don't you dare let Mel get outside. Leave it to me, bro. All I have to do is block this exit from Mel, right? Yep, I'm counting on you. Now there are two more left. Uh, we'll even up with some manpower to spare. It's game over, Mel. Let's do it. <laughs> you idiot. That's what you get for messing with my customers. I'm not going to forgive you for... Uh, just for crying. That should be enough. We've got my stuff back, and there's been no harm done, other than wasting my time. Even so, we have to teach this kid some proper manners. You never know when she might do it again. Don't worry about such minor stuff. I say it's already forgiven. Let's just leave it at that. Besides, the little ones got some guts to steal from a member of the Radical Dreamers. Hey, don't you call me a little un. I've got a name too, you know. It's Mel. Oh, how feisty. Though she's got real spirit too. But weren't you crying just now? Or were you just faking it? I tell ya, she's gonna be a, a real mean one when she grows up. What you mean by that? Whoops, I guess you're still just a little un. Don't worry, just forget it. I said, don't you call me a little un. Hey, are you sure you want to leave it at that? I just don't get you. Oh well. No use bothering with it now. Then I'll go ahead and wait for you at the docks. Uh, come and find me when you're ready to go. Alright, let's get moving then. cause any more mischief, but promise to play with me again. Not a chance. You better not charge me, dog. Come the wind. Alright, you're charging me. I like to think that he hits the net and then falls like face first. Alright. 
Element. Allocate. Door here. You. Remove all elements from you. This is uh, such a nice thing. Glad I discovered it. Um, kid. Let's just uh, fill in the blanks for you. I need to figure out how to like access this stuff. There are capsules here. Oh, those restore HP. Oh. All right, you have two magma bombs. That's good. I don't know how I feel about Eagle Eye being right there, but whatever. All right, Korcha. Wanna go back to Termina? Let's go back to Termina. Hey, let's go. It was nice knowing you. This is goodbye. What your left party. Can I have your my stuff back though? Was that sound my stuff getting back? You had some nice stuff on you. Uh Barry? Hello? an island it's probably the, uh, the earth earth shrine or whatever it's called It'd be so cool oh you're resting now where's your take time off me rest too a lot of things might have changed. What I really need to do is save. And conflict with Pope Pong. Pump, pump, pump. When backup dancers, you and me. Crescent Island is probably where croissants come from. <laughs> uh, I can't help but say that in that way. Croissants. The Dragonians were really a magnificent bunch. Just one lick and a mop in the floor. I feel good. Okay. I was thinking maybe Crescent Island is where people go. Hey, I have to think about this correctly. Is Crescent Island where people go to watch a play? Or is Crescent Island? No. Crescent Island is where you go when you want to meet someone on the solstice. Or is that Whale Tail Island? No, I think it's Crescent Island. I think I'm right. And we gotta watch out for like ghost dragons in the film. Always popping out of nowhere. Jack, have you got your stuff back from Korcha? Good call. Edge of bets now. I did not. Why isn't it letting me go to the side like I, I did before? Guess I have to do it here? Yeah, that's obnoxious. He had a, um, he had a cure-all on him. Or 
or recover all or whatever it's called. No, yeah, no, 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 selling. No, 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 no. I just want to buy your mermaid, man. Whaletail Island is where the Dai Li said that Appa was sold to. Crescent is right. Ah, yeah. Still got my my avatar knowledge. Had to think about it though. It's it's probably about that time where I should rewatch uh, Avatar: The Last Airbender. Feel like I only watched it last year. Because it came on Netflix. I mean, no, it wasn't last year. I didn't have Netflix last year. It was a couple of years ago. Actually, let's get the fortune of Razzly or Razzy or whatever your name is. Conflict can occur anywhere. The only way to be rid of conflict is to remove its roots. Nothing will be resolved by just glancing at the surface. Okay. Free fortune telling. Great. Do you have any more churros? Nice. All right, let's see if Van Orgo will help me out. I'd rather have Van than go. Here's the festival may be canceled too, blah, 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 blah. All right. I think he's mad because I didn't like his painting. I'm just gonna go with that. Now that I have Kid in my party, maybe uh, I can trigger something with Go. Yum, 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 yum. Okay. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay, so we don't really have any indication of where we're supposed to go right now, but maybe if I'm lucky, I leave some indication will be given. It is kind of weird that Kid is basically telling me where I'm supposed to go. Oh, it's Glenn. Forgot about that guy. The general and his men are headed for Fort Dragonia. There has been word that the major power of the East, Pore, is up to something suspicious. They seem to have heard the rumors of the frozen flame in El Nido and are coming to investigate. My, then that means the Pore army might invade this town at any time now. I wonder if we will be alright. Yes, that is why we are moving to the fort for a while. That fort is far from town, so it is not used normally, but, it, but has good defenses. Uh, I was ordered to remain at the manor and protect Miss Riddell, but he felt very uneasy about the way General Viper was acting before he left, so... Boy, Serge, did you hear that? When I was snoozing away in Goldov, Lynx and his mob hightailed it out of the manor. That fort's supposedly a ruin built by the extinct Dragonians. I heard there's been all kinds of mystic rituals there. It's said that the Dragon Tear was needed for the rituals. Bloody bastards, what are they up to now? Serge, this is no longer just our problem. We don't stop these buggers now. They're gonna cause some major heck around here. Fort Dragonia is on top of Mount Pyre southeast of here. It'll be hard to get there by land, so the question is, how are we going to get, get a boat?
Blonde braids, a blood red blouse. That sounds like the description of that thief from the Radical Dreamers. That red bandana is just like the ghost Karsh was describing. But what? You want to take us on or something? Uh, sorry, Dory, but we're in a bit of a rush to that Fort Dragonia of yours. What business do you have at the fort? That makes me even more suspicious. I will draw my sword, if needs be. Oh, Glenn, stop that. Your brother would never have drawn a sword in such circumstances. Get my brother out of this. Oh, I don't get your knickers in a knot. Uh, I don't care if you... I don't care if you draw your sword or what, but I ain't stopping for you. See ya. Alright, forgive me for my rash behavior. Come to think of it, I really have no interest in who you are. Really, I only want to know the truth of what is happening here. I shall follow my own way to find the truth. If you intend to go to the fort, I would offer you a word of advice. When you get on your boat, first head north, and then east, you should find a small island there. A retired dragoon now lives there. Find him and ask for his advice. Uh, there are many frightful rumors about that fort. Uh, you know, you never know what to expect there. Is Glenn supposed to be Cloud? All we need to do now is find a boat. Let's get a move on it. Gee, I wonder where we're gonna find a boat. Also, I needed to save like 10 minutes ago. Why don't you get him right now? I, I was, you know, I was actually kind of wondering if he was going to join right there. It would have been very weird and uh, it would have had to be very, very forced, but I was expecting it. Did I hit no? Mark 